Hi, I'm Nico Rosberg. Hi, I'm Lewis Hamilton. It's time to get street smart. Lewis, catch. Yeah, nice one. Reaction time is an important aspect for a Formula 1 driver. It is important for the safety of the driver and also determine how well he'll do in the race. Everything comes into that, you know, I mean, even reacting to the corner that's arriving. The more quickly the driver reacts, the better will be the result. A simple example of that is the starts. When those lights go out, the drivers have to react quickly. On the start, you want to be able to react as fast as you can there, so that you can pull away, because every tenth or, or tenth of a second means something like half a meter by the first corner. At the start, where I have all the cars around me and doing different things, I need to react all the time to various situations. And our drivers really tune their reactions to make sure they can respond. They respond to the lights or they respond to the behavior of the car. They respond to events that are going on around them. They're really highly tuned athletes and the reaction time is vital. It's not necessarily ha about having the fastest reaction times, but it's, it's about maybe about having the more consistent reaction times. And that reaction time is just as important for us on the road. We see lots of different events, lots of different circumstances. We see pedestrians coming across the road and we must also be tuned. So maybe our reactions can't be quite as acute as a racing driver, but by paying attention, by thinking about it, making sure we don't relax too much, our reactions will be there when something happens. <sighs> Thanks. <laughs> Not bad either. I have good reactions too. <laughs>